for tuning back in to Brick View 7. Today I am reviewing the Bricktober Toys R Us exclusive Batman minifigure pack. It is for ages 6 and up. There are 27 pieces and it has 4 minifigures. It is worth $20. Here we have our first minifigure, Money Batman. As you can tell, he comes with one hundred dollar bill a one hundred dollar bill as you can see right there so now for the minifigure you can see that he has some pants and a vest that are covered in money it's just that his feet are not covered in money and he even has the money printed on his the sides of his arms but you can see underneath it very little though a black shirt you can see a black shirt underneath that and then he does have his iconic batman mask and you can take that off to reveal his face which is a meh face really and you can see that it's just completely black on the top with white slits to make it look like his actual mask in the movie and then we can go to the back and as you can tell he has more mon money printed on the back but there's no printing for the legs right here but there is printing for the leg right here and the leg right here and lastly he does have a second expression same black thing at the top except he's just smiling in this expression so that is all there is for money batman here we have our second minifigure which is easter bunny batman so as you can tell easter bunny batman does come with something and that something is a basket with an egg inside so as you can tell you can easily take the egg outside the basket so that is all there is for the accessories and now let's get on to the minifigure so on the minifigure, you can tell that there is no printing on the legs, but there is printing on the torso, which is his regular outfit, but in light blue to match the outfit itself. And you can tell that he has a little white belt. And his mask is not his usual mask. It's a bunny mask to go with the outfit. And you can easily take that off, and you can just see that there's just some pink in the ears. And then his facial expression is not the happiest, probably because he does not want to be wearing this outfit. And then on the back of the minifigure, you can tell that there is no second expression and there's no printing again on the back of the legs. He has, you can see more of the white belt and then you can just, there's just some printing on the back of his torso. And yeah. That is all there is for Easter Bunny Batman. Here we have our third Batman minifigure. This is Wizard Batman. So as you can tell, Wizard Batman comes with a staff. And the staff consists of a black stick with a bat on top. It's And you can just take off the bat. So it's just a bat piece with a stick. That's all. So now on to the minifigure. So, as you can tell, he is wearing a robe with a bunch of white or silver bats with gold edges. And then underneath he's wearing another robe, but this time it's white. And there's um, a golden belt wrapped around it. And you can see right here that there is a necklace that he's wearing that is in a shape of a bat. In this minifigure, you can see that he's wearing his iconic mask. And when you take it off, you can see his face. It's, it's a meth face. And now we can go to the back. And as you can tell, there is a cape. And when you flip the cape up, you can see that there's no printing on the back. But if you turn his face... You, if 
find out that there's a second expression, and in this expression, he's kind of shocked and surprised. So that is all there is for the third minifigure, Wizard Batman. Here we have our last minifigure. It is the Roman Batman. So, the Roman Batman comes with a Gladius and a shield. So, the Gladius is this small little sword. A little bit bigger than like a knife. So, it's just a small little sword. And his shield is this, and it's just covered in bats. And he holds it on to, on the, like this, from the back. So, for the minifigure himself you can see that he's wearing sandals he has some armor on and he does have a custom helmet which is really cool it's a brand new print so as you can see there's like um print to act as feathers and then you can just use helmet and stuff and then underneath you can see that he is a pretty determined angry face on him so then when you go to the back you can tell that he does have a second expression and this one is a more surprised yeah it's just more surprised like astonished like amazed like he didn't expect this and then you can see that he has a cape and you can tell under the cape that there is no printing unless you want to count like this double color molded as printing but I don't so that is all there is for the Roman Batman